Well, since they've had these conversations, we've had other areas that are drastically changing college football with NIL and portal and all the different things. So there's uh, there's a considerable amount of information to consider. And I think that this could be a very pivotal time, in my opinion, for college football. We have a good product right now, a really good product that's driving the television market. People love college football. So I'm, I'm a little concerned about whether we need to really fix something that's not broke, in my opinion. Now, the A team that I mentioned, what, five, six years ago, I still think it's the best concept, in my opinion, for everybody in college football, which is important. So the decisions that are made for college football are like decisions that are made for lawmakers. They should be able to try to satisfy and keep the majority happy. That's what we do. That's why we vote. I think the 18 playoff allows all conference champions to be in, and then your conference is important. You know, we don't have the discussion over which conferences are stronger than the others. If you win, you're in. And then it also allows at least one team from the lower level to get in so they know they have a shot. Because as it is right now, they do not have a shot. It, it's extremely difficult. Cincinnati may now have the best shot, right? But it's still difficult. So uh, when you go to the 12 or even further, you're now treading water in academic calendars, dead week, finals week, bowl games, how many regular season games can you have, and potentially a number of games that could push right up there with an NFL schedule. And we still are we still are, are working with amateur athletes. So I'm not sure that that's the answer right now based on what, what all is going on because my academic schedule may not be the same as Stanford's. So is somebody going to play? Are we going to play each other in a playoff and we're in finals week and they're out of school? There's issues there. So I'm not saying I have the answers. I'm just saying that I think that we need to be careful because we have a big time game right now that that the people in this country love to watch. I'd be careful about changing it too much. It's, we, we have to try to make decisions for what would be the majority. So we could go back to the year that we went to the Fiesta Bowl, okay? If, if they were deciding which two teams went and played for the national championship without a computer, if it was a committee, we would have been in. But before the season, we signed up for the system that was in place. And so people said, how upset are you? Well, I'd love to play in the game, but I signed up for that. And that's how it works. The computer spit me out as third. I don't know what to tell you. So in a sense, <clears throat> we have to be careful about um, changing things, even though what you're saying is true, but there's other side effects or repercussions for the system you're wanting, or not saying you're wanting, or that you're talking about. and. Um, that could affect bowls. So let's just say that you're 23rd in the country, you win eight games, and you're going to go to a bowl game. Is that bowl game still there if you're to an eight or 12 team playoff, or is that bowl game history based on television, based on what people want to watch because of the playoffs? So there's, you know, maybe this year for Oklahoma State, oh yeah, it could be beneficial, but maybe it couldn't be for whoever's 23rd in the country and going to the Liberty Bowl, whatever that might be. So there's a lot of things to weigh. I, 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 do, I will say this. I think the decisions that need to be made need to be made by people that understand the profession, not people that aren't in our profession. That's my opinion. Are you worried that's happening right now? Well, I don't know because I don't know who's making decisions. I really don't. I don't know who's making decisions on any of this stuff. Did, I mean, does anybody know who's making decisions? I don't know that we know that. I just, I would just like those decisions to be made by people that are that are in the middle of it and could make the best decision for everybody involved. That's just my opinion on it. For more information, you can visit TulsaWorld.com.